In this episode we'll show you 5 seamless transitions which are perfect for Instagram. The only thing you need is a tripod and your phone. Let's go! Hey there, my name is Gabriel and yesterday I had to create an Instagram video. In this episode we'll share the transitions we created for that video. I'm gonna show you the editing process. I will use Adobe Premiere on my laptop. But the editing for those transitions is so simple that you can replicate it on any video editor software, even on your phone. I'll break them down so you can see how to master them. The first one is drawing the curtains and changing the outfits. So you think you were right? Here the most important thing is to place the tripod on one place and don't change the place until you don't finish recording all the videos. If you change a little bit the position of the tripod, the two pictures will not match together and the transition will not look seamless. The editing part is extremely simple. Just cut the first clip when the curtain is closing and cut the second clip just before you open the curtain. Go put up a fight. Mm -hmm. Now there are two things you have to consider. We are shooting with natural light, so the light environment can change and also when you press the start and stop button on your phone, you can move the phone a little bit, so it will not be a perfect match between the two clips. To solve that issue, we're gonna use the cross dissolve transition. That's a very simple transition, which every software has it, even the most simple one. Let's move to the next one. Here I really don't have any idea how to name that transition, but here the idea is very simple. You have an object which is blocking the camera and a person is passing through that object. In the moment the person is passing the object, you're doing the cut. The whole day I have some construction works. I cannot record video normally. Five minutes later, I hope the guy will not continue cutting. Here the editing is even simpler, you just have to cut the first clip in the moment the person is behind the subject. And start the second clip immediately before the person goes out. And like that the transition looks seamless. And of course apply the cross dissolve, that will smooth the transition. The third one is the match cut transition and here you have a lot of variation. The main idea is that you cut in the action. You can clap, you can snap, you can throw your hair, just do something to distract the viewer. That kind of transition works the best if there is some sound. When you clap there is a sound, when you snap there is a sound, so the sound distracts the viewer's brain and makes the transition seamless. So do something where there is a strong sound and cut in the moment when the sound is the strongest. like using sound effects, so I want the sound effect exactly when the clap appears, like that the sound is cleaner, but you can use the original sound of the video. Short advertising, go and follow me on Instagram, there I post a lot of short b-rolls and cool videos and pictures. Now let's go back to the video. Next we have two more variations of the match cut transition and here again cut in the action and add cross dissolve. And now we came to the most popular transition online, that's the lens cover. Most people do it with the hand cover. Here we're gonna use some props to do it a little bit more spicy. For the first one we're gonna use a flower and for the second one we're gonna use a hat. Don't forget to add the cross dissolve here because the creamy color of the flower will blend really nice together between the two clips and the viewer will not even understand what happened. Here I'm looking for a nice place where the flower will cover the whole lens and for the second clip I'll do exactly the same. Now 
Now the second one is when you throw the head here cut in the moment the head is covering the lens and the second clip cut in the moment the head is already rotating and going out of the camera. Like that the transition looks the best. And of course a little bit of cross dissolve. I think cross dissolve is the word I said the most in that video. So give a like for the cross dissolve guy. Next transition is the teleport one. You're gonna teleport yourself like in a computer game. You're gonna go out from one side of the frame and teleport yourself in the other one. My hands were not adequate, so it should look like... Better to show you the video, looks better. Cut the first clip immediately after you go out of the frame and cut the second clip just before you appear in the frame and just glue them together. It will look very seamless. It will look like... Second more complicated version is to add a mask. You can overlap the two clips and in the moment you start disappearing from the frame, you already start going in the second frame. So you're gonna clone yourself in the frame. It will look really cool. Thank you for joining me on that short tutorial, don't forget to destroy the like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell, write me something in the comment and see you in the next video. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram.